Hey, I'll warn you guys now, if you're going to be inappropriate, I will have supervision down and give all of you a Saturday school for next year. So knock it off. Okay. Knock it off and bow, bow the knee Ooh. to the, the at the altar of LGBTQ. Okay. Bow the knee. Knock it off, students. But what what did that one student say? The one I think it might have been a girl. It sounded like she said, "Why are you showing this to, to like kids? kids during that like to the two girls being face to face with you know, each other?" It, it, even in California, and this is very interesting. You know, I, I'm not saying kids across the country are sick of this indoctrination. But some are starting to catch on that, okay, another pride thing, we're supposed to celebrate, we're supposed to say yes, 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 we bow down. Uh, you know, it's really, it, it's really interesting. I would love to hear more stories like this, and that's why I'm just still surprised at the headline that the kids reacted this way. Well, hey, it, and the teacher clearly has not watched Breakfast Club because threatening students <laughs> with Saturday <laughs> detention. whoop a doo doo You yeah. see what happens in Saturday detention? Many have reacted harshly toward the teacher, and this was shown in a math class? Yes. Um, but what Robbie Starbuck uh, said on Twitter, he posted the clip and noted that some 10th grade students came forward to tell me that this video was played in all classes that day, not just math class. Good on these students yeah. for actually pointing out what is so very clear to everyone else. Why are you showing this? Why? Everyone is a it's safe space. Everyone is included. If you don't talk about sexuality, you just talk about, oh, I don't know, students who should be learning math and should be learning English and should be learning history. Not her story, history.